Hi, this is Maria Trent and here we are in Sydney, Australia and today we'll be profiling a very special guest. His name is Tan Boy. Anh là một ca sĩ, kim nhạc sĩ rất nổi tiếng, đã từng đi lưu diễn khắp nơi trên toàn thế giới. Và người ta biết đến anh vì anh là người Việt đầu tiên đã được vào finalist in Australian Idol 2008. But first, here we are at Cabramatta, Australia's hot spot, Asian hot spot. And we're going to actually take it out to the crowd and do a box pop where we're going to ask the people whether or not they know and what they think about Tan Boy. So follow me. Do you know who Tan Boy is? Yes. <laughs> what do you think of him? Um, I think he's a good singer. Um, anh này là anh nào không cơ? Anh hay là người của uh, Australian Idol hay không? Anh này là ai không ạ? À, trong cái này đó là trong cái idol Trong cái idol vậy Do you know who this is? No? Oh, uh, I'm not sure of his name, but he, uh, he did really well on Australian Idol Tan, yeah, 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 I think his name is Tan. And I people recognize you. Thanks. <laughs> good work on the top eight. Uh, you're really good looking. This guy freaking rocks! So there you have it, some thoughts to Mr. Tan Boy, but our mission isn't over yet. Let's hyperspace to the man himself and see what he thinks. The man himself in his natural habitat. What do you want from me? Just a few questions from a fan base in Western Sydney. All right. All right. Okay. Question one. What was your worst and best memory in high school? Um, the worst uh, memory of high school would have to be being bullied, being the only Asian kid in the whole place. Um, I remember the first two weeks were pretty terrible, being called like Ching Chong, people calling you fried rice or, or, or Hokkien noodle, or calling you Chinese when I'm actually Vietnamese. The best, um, the best thing about school Best thing, best thing, best thing. Just great to be able to meet people from all different um, landscapes of life, I suppose. Nerds, jocks, and musos. Who inspires you? Stevie Wonder. Just an amazing vocalist, an amazing writer, an amazing musician. Um, my parents inspire me. You know, to hear their story where it's life and death, um, it's very inspiring, I suppose. You know, when things get a bit rough, you sit back and go and put it put into perspective. Uh, it's not life and death. I have food to eat. I have everything that I ever need. Um, so it all puts in, you know, gives you a, a better idea of what life's all about. If you were an animal, what would you be and why? 
I'll be a bird. So I can fly and it's an experience how it is to fly. I've been an albatross. The biggest <laughs> They are the biggest bird in the world and they don't flap. They saw <laughs> I'd like to be a rat. Don't be afraid to dream. Just don't be afraid. I think you can do anything. Nothing is impossible. The only thing that's impossible is when you say that it's impossible. You listen to your heart. Just not to your mind, not to your brain. I think that's really important. Don't be afraid to break stereotypes. Don't be afraid to stand up for yourself and tell your parents, mum and dad, I want to do this because it feels right. Have fun. Live life, you know. Experience new things. Get yourself out of your comfort zone because we all get, you know, we do this, do that. It's all so comfortable. Just get out of your comfort zone. Push yourself. Because when you do push yourself, You'll see things, you'll hear things, you'll feel things that are different that you go, holy crap, my god, I never knew. So, you know, live life. Live life as though it's your last day on earth. Be good to your mum and your dad, of course, um, but be really respectful to mum and dad because if it wasn't for them, you wouldn't be here today, so. There you have it, Calm Boy himself, up close and personal, gorilla style. Please check out our website at www.vitlishentertainment.com and for more information, check out... <laughs> check out his website on myspace.com forward slash Music.